Welcome to William Edwards. We'd like to show you around our school so you can see for yourself what's going on here. We're all year 10 so we know the school really well. Let's start by introducing ourselves. My name's Fola, I love drama and I also took part in the Duke of Edinburgh programme where I walked 26 miles. Hi, I'm JJ, like Fola, I like drama and I've also been on the Cornwall trip. Hi, my name's Red. I've recently joined Student Execs. That's why I'm in business dress. Hi, I'm Tommy. I'm a PE ambassador. I play football to school and referee as well. I'm Megan. I love art and last year I took part in making the decorations for the school carnival. I hope to maybe pursue a career in art. So hopefully you're ready now to come on a journey with us around our school. We're very proud of it. The learning we do. The outcome we achieve. The wider development opportunities we get. The relationships we form and the support we get. Come and see our newest science lab. It's a great space for carrying out experiments and developing the scientists of the future. Over the course of our five-year journey at William Edwards, pupils will attend at least 1,520 hours of maths lessons. When you add in that revision session and maths watch homework as well, that's a lot of maths. Just as well as taught not only with rigour, but also fun approaches. Walking down this corridor always makes me hungry because pupils are often making food and catering that smells really good. All pupils have regular food lessons in lower school, a really important aspect of their healthy lifestyle learning, as well as teaching them important life skills. Let's see what's on the menu today. All of our pupils take GCSE English and GCSE Literature, as well as the core skills of reading, writing, communicating fluently. We also develop views and opinions about social and cultural political issues. The Jack Petchy workshop helps us develop our public speaking skills and in lower schools the Accelerated Reader programme supports pupils developing their skills and reading for the pleasure. History, Geography and RE gives pupils a wide knowledge of local, national and global issues. We highly recommend their trips. Always good fun, whether it's a geography field trip on a beach or a poignant trip to Auschwitz or war cemeteries. The learning becomes so real when you're actually there. As with all of our subjects, our teachers make the learning engaging by using technology, our write on walls and immersive activities. Dance and drama are popular at William Edwards. In dance, pupils not only devise and perform their own dancing, but they choreograph the work of other dancers, often working with industry professionals to achieve amazing outcomes. Recent work with a local special school led to dance event which was nothing short of stunning and friendships across this school were made for life. Drama is taught across the school and has given many a shy pupil their first opportunity to speak their mind. We often focus on topical and challenging issues, so the learning is a form of personal development as well as an academic skill. Trips to the theatre are popular and the school shows always get packed audiences. Music BTEC pupils run the technical aspects of our show and the talent show they host each year is a great night for all. Pupils choose to play a range of musical instruments. We showcase these whenever we can. Art and photography are subjects enjoyed by many and examples of their talents are displayed around the school. Trips to galleries and aspects of our Year 7 Creative Curriculum course are also popular elements of the art curriculum. And those with practical skills who love a bit of machinery really enjoy the design technology course. They use some serious kit. All pupils in Year 7 will learn a foreign language and many continue this to GCSE. Trips abroad help to contextualise the learning and events such as the French Café Day are lots of fun. We use IT throughout the day in classrooms. Staff use projection and quizzes like Kahoot to help us check our learning and share ideas. And our new Google Suite allows the staff to communicate easy with pupils beyond the classroom. Our IT rooms themselves are well equipped for those studying computer science and business and IT courses and all pupils in lower school learn coding as well. Sports is big at William Edwards, but you don't have to be an elite athlete to enjoy it. We have a great eight-court badminton centre, a state-of-the-art gym, a huge field for PE lessons and training our highly successful teams. We've got cups and shields for everything, but we also cater for those who like something more individual. We've been district athletics champions for 13 consecutive years and we compete enthusiastically in everything else from rounders to trampolining, rugby to badminton. Sport isn't just importance in the curriculum, 
It's also a social development platform. Sports leaders are pupils who develop their leadership skills through taking coaching courses and supporting younger pupils at sporting events. And House Sports Day is a highly competitive affair for those in the stands cheering for their teams just as much as the athletes running. Learning isn't always easy and sometimes pupils need extra help. Maybe they have dyslexia, maybe they have a medical issue that affects their learning. Maybe they just struggle with some things and need the chance to be shown in a different way or more often. Learning support at this school is planned around what a pupil needs at each stage of their journey through school and it is flexible enough to change as we do. As you can see, learning matters to all of us here at William Edwards, but what makes it possible is the relationship we have with the staff and the support that is available. Personal development is key. Our teachers deliver PSHE lessons that help us learn about everything from managing our money, or the money we hope to have, to keeping ourselves safe online or in the community. But our teachers also teach us far more subtly by engaging us in things like the Duke of Edinburgh Award, the Student Leadership Programme, trips and events. Relationships that are built through these opportunities and the wider learning that happens is so important. We hope this short film has helped you to experience not just what our school looks like, but how it feels and how we feel about it. As we go into Year 11 in September, there will be lots of challenges for us, considering careers, applying for post-16 education, taking GCSEs. We're looking forward to that because we know the school has prepared us for it and the staff here will give us 100% support.